Hey guys, this is Kyle Newton. Um, another blog about what went on uh, during NASCAR. At Phoenix, between the championship uh, drivers, not much really happened. Um, uh, the only thing, the only thing that happened was uh, uh, Carl Edwards and Tony Stewart are now um, are still three points behind each other, but they've they both put a another a huge gap over third place, which is Kevin Harvick. Um, so yeah, Kevin Harvick is no longer eligible to win the championship with just one race left to go. The winner of Phoenix was none other than my favorite driver, Casey Kane. I'm 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 so proud of him. I I knew that uh I knew he had to win a race sooner or later because of how good he was running. And I'm I'm I wasn't expecting him to win Phoenix. I I was maybe I was looking at maybe a homestead win. But um, yeah, I, I, I knew Casey had to, he was going to win a race sooner or later because of how good he was running. So, yeah, I'm, I'm really excited for Casey. Um, it's been a while since he won a, a race in the Cup Series. So, I'm, I'm, I'm very, very proud of him. Um, another incident between, uh, Brian Vickers and Matt Kenseth came about. This time, uh, Matt, Matt Kenseth got sent into the wall by Brian Vickers. Somebody has got to do something about him. I'm Vickers. Um, that's like the fourth time since Richmond that he's retaliated against somebody. And he was he was running really good. He had a very good car, and uh, started on the pole, led the first 37 laps. What was cool though was Tony Stewart's three wide pass between um, the 36 car and uh, well the 36 car was squeezed between them, and Tony Stewart went Tony Stewart went above. 36 and Matt Kenseth car. That was a pretty cool pass by Tony Stewart. Um, who do I think is going to win the championship? Very close right now. You never know what Tony really um i don't know how well he's going to do this weekend but uh i think that at Phoenix. Luckily there wasn't no fuel strategy involved at the Phoenix race, so it didn't mess up the championship like it did last year. Danny Hamlin should have won. But uh this year I'm kind of neutral because Carl has been very good all season. He deserves this, but Tony Stewart's late surge I'm kind of neutral. I'm 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 I'd like to see Tony Stewart win because he's my dad's driver and he'd be It'd be great, great for him because he owns, um, he he's the owner of the team that he drives for now. Plus, it'd be a third championship for him.
but here lately he's been really he's he's impressing me with his attitude and his behavior. Second week in a row, he went up and congratulated the winners of the race in victory lane. Of course, it's also the second week in a row that he's finished second. But if he, I, I believe that Carl Edwards will be on top of his game, possibly winning Homestead. If not, he'll be second or third again and uh, winning the championship. I, it's pretty safe to say that Carl Edwards will be tough to beat um, Sunday. I don't know what Tony, I don't know anything about what, I have no clue what Tony Stewart's going to do. He's not predictable at all. You never know how good Tony Stewart's going to do. Um, but Tony Stewart, pretty, pretty good uh, shot at winning the championship as well. I just say Carl Edwards has the has the edge. Um, if Carl Edwards does in fact um, win the championship and not win Homestead, he will be the first driver to win the championship with one win since Matt Kenseth. And uh, seems to be a trend with Roush now, but that it can't be helped. Consistency overrides wins sometimes if it means getting the championship. And uh, Carl Edwards has been good all year. He's been on top of the points all year. And if, if he wins the championship with one win, then so be it. Um, I, I've seen a lot of Roush fans make comments saying, thinking of how funny it would be if that did happen. And... Uh, Talking about how the chase came to be because of uh, Matt Kenseth's championship, and they don't like Rob. Brian Vickers because. Guy he was messing with was Matt Kenseth or what? It's hard for me to make sense of this myself. Me me saying this. So. Um. Um, be happy if Tony Stewart wins it. I'll be fine with fine with it if Carl does. Just uh, just gonna have to wait and see what happens during the race this weekend. That's all I'm saying. And uh, I uh, hope you enjoyed my blog and thank you and God bless. I oh, went. Thanks for listening.